Hi folks, good evening. Cracker three, two, one, boom here. Uh, welcome to the channel. If this is your first time, or hey, definitely welcome back. Uh, reacting to a short clip by W Picks Eleven News, a woman was shot by a neighbor in the same building, and. Uh, happened in the Bronx and at this point I'm not surprised I'm really not violence continues to escalate so let's hit play emotions after a violent chain of events domestic violence with a twist caught in the middle of it all 41 year old Hamina Garay Police say she tried to help her next door neighbor during a domestic dispute when Garay herself became a victim. And she's an excellent mother and she got caught up in somebody else's situation that she didn't deserve to be. Police were called to this building in the Lincoln houses around 8.30 Wednesday morning for a domestic disturbance that escalated into Garay being shot. Police say it started as a fight between the suspect and his girlfriend. They live in apartment 6A. Apparently, Garay could not take hearing commotion coming from her neighbor's apartment, so she left her apartment 6D and went over to intervene. But that's when things go from bad to worse. Sources tell PIX11 News Garay's husband and the suspect got into a fight. The suspect then pulled out a gun and shot Garay several times. Bullets hit her left eye, back, buttocks, and stomach. Whoever did that had malice, and they need to be found, please. Garay is known as a nice person around the building, a woman who loves her family, especially her daughters. She's a very nice young lady. She always pleasant. You know, she have a whole bunch of little girls, some pretty little girls, yeah. Pearl Newelder knows Gray's family very well, but never saw the suspect. I'm scared. I'm nervous, you know. I don't know who this guy is. But police know exactly who he is. Officers in riot gear had to break down his door because his girlfriend would not let them in. I, I feel sad for the family. I feel, you know, it's the kids. What he's accused of doing, beating up his own girlfriend and shooting his next door neighbor has everyone on edge. While he's still on the run, this neighbor sends this message. Walk away. You know what I'm saying? Why would you shoot a, I mean, a, 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 a woman anyway? I mean, come on. It's, 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 it's not worth it. Wow. Sad part about it is, is that those little girls don't have their mom. I, I don't know what to say anymore. I'm just like, Life is just not valued by a lot of people. <sighs> what a waste. But the sad part about it is, and I hate to say it or sound cold or malice, this is why you don't butt into other people's business. If it's bothering you that much, call the police. Because look at what happened. She lost her life. Her daughters don't have their mom. These kids are now going to grow up without their own mother. And for what? Nobody wins here. Nobody. It's a shame. It really is. My condolences go out to the family. They didn't say how many kids she had, but I'm assuming more than two. It's, it's kind of funny because when you do enough of these reactions, after a while you're just like, you know, people killing people, relatives hurting other relatives, robberies, rapes, murders, subway stuff. It's difficult. It really is. Especially when you're just trying to live day to day. Well, that was my reaction.
This is Cracker. Three, two, one. Boom. Um, if you're a subscriber, hit the bell icon, select all, so you'll know when new videos are uploaded. Um, you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe. Um, leave a like to any video. You can leave a comment as well. And um, tell someone else about the channel. Um, take care. God bless. Be safe. Peace.